Guten Tag, Mesme. Wie geht's im Moi, Dieter? Ich bin Dieter. So, uh, I erroneously said in my last video, uh, performance anxiety, uh, that it was an end of the year party. You no, know, my friend Lester, who has a sealed art where I have, uh, he has a gallery and he does really nice framing. So any of you in the Hamilton area, if you want to look at some good Dieter art or pick, actually pick Asso art, head down to uh, the corner of Main Street and Gage, right across from Gage Park, beautiful Gage Park in downtown East Hamilton. And you can check out some of Dita's fabulous watercolors. I've got about 16 up there, as well as other art. And if you need anything framed, uh, Lester and his son Julian at Sealed Art do an amazing job of framing and they are very reasonably priced. Anyway, Lester, it's not an end of the year party, it's the end of summer party. So I just wanted to correct that. And since we're talking about parties, um, Dita's gonna share some of his favorite drinks with you. Uh, you might get the impression that Dita smokes a lot and drinks a lot if you watch any of his over a thousand plus videos. But I don't smoke, uh, it's a shtick I use. and. Uh, if I, I seem congested, it's not because I smoke. <clears throat> it's uh, because of the allergies and they, uh, they affect my immune system and I get a lot of mucus buildup, maybe more information than you need. And uh, my uh, lymphatic system gets swollen. So that's why my voice changes sometimes, unless I just feel like changing my voice. So uh, I don't know if... Uh, these are really good. You know, my favorite drink is ice cold distilled water. And then I say my second favorite drink is uh, ice cold lemonade made with maple syrup and real lemons. And I like, I don't like to drink too much coffee because if I have more than one a day, I get all jittery and uh, I'm very sensitive to Stuff that's why I don't drink. I, I can literally get on an empty stomach. I can get a buzz on one beer. So speaking of beer. Okay. Up in Canada, we've got this thing called Steam Whistle. It's a real good Pilsner. Made, the, made to the German purity standards. And I know a bit about these guys. Um... They're the sons of the guy who started the Upper Canada Natural Brewing Company, which w used to be my favorite beers back in the day. But uh, he, the, their old man sold, uh, sold that business to uh, Sleeman Brewery in Guelph. And I think they got rid of Upper Canada, made six really good beers, and I don't know if they even make anything, if Sleeman just phased them out. But his sons wanted to make beer, so... Uh, they make steam whistle, and what's really cool about these guys is uh, it's downtown at the Roundhouse, which is the old train station uh, right across from the Rogers Center where the Blue Jays play and the uh, Argonauts. No, the Argonauts play at BMO Field now, I think. Anyway, uh, their brewmaster is a really cool guy. I think he's from Czechia, and he... Uh, he lives on top of the brewery. So this is good beer, if, in case you're wondering. And one of my favorites, Belgians make really good stuff. This is a, a strong beer. It's a champagne style beer. It's called Chimay. This is the red label, which is 7% alcohol by volume. Serve it ice cold. This stuff is really delicious, but it's not for the faint of heart. So Chimay, made by Trappist monks. And it's their beer sales that keep the monastery open in uh, Scourmount Abbey in Belgium. There you go. And uh, when it comes to wine, I like Cabernet Sauvignon, that's my favorite. So this is Lindemann's, an Australian beer. It's, uh, 
Australian red wine. And there's a, another brand I like that has a bird on it. I forget. It's an organic Cabernet from uh, California. The state I love to hate now because it's full of so many weirdos. Anyway, no offense to decent Californians, but you got way too many weirdos down there for my liking. <laughs> okay. And I'm not really a hard liquor fan, but my favorite vodka is Stolichnaya. I don't have any of that. If I buy a bottle of hard liquor, it lasts me a year. Case in point, I have this 12-year-old Glenfiddich Scotch. You can see how much is gone. And I bought this in uh, March. And I shared it, so that's... I don't really drink that much, but anyway. There. So I'm, I'm, the reason I'm showing this, I'm going to a party tonight, but I, I don't think I'll be drinking much because I have to drive. But I'll have one or two probably uh, over the course of six hours. I think that'd be okay. Anyway, happy plucking. There. Now you know what Dita drinks when he drinks alcohol. Be designed.